Hello, welcome to Two Car Pros. Today we're going to show you how to change the oil on a 2003 Chevrolet Tahoe. This repair is rated a 3 out of 10 because you have to lift the car into the air and it does require a few tools, but still, anyone can do it. Tools needed for this job is a 15mm socket, a ratchet, an oil filter wrench, and a pair of gloves. Materials needed to make this repair is 6 quarts of oil and a new oil filter. Important safety notice, it is important that all the work on this repair be done on a flat surface. You wouldn't want the car to roll away or fall off the jack stands. First, put your 15mm socket on your ratchet and break the bolt loose. With the bolt loose, the rest is easily removable by hand. Be ready though with a catch basin because all the oil is going to be flowing out of that hole. When the oil comes down to a trickle or stops altogether, replace the bolt and snug it back up with your ratchet. The oil filter is located in the same general vicinity. Since it is at an awkward location, an oil filter wrench is highly recommended. But again, be ready with an oil catch basin uh, for the, a bunch of oil will be rushing out of it as well, as you can see. Once the oil has stopped flowing so much, continue to unscrew the oil filter, but try to keep it opening up for the oil filter is full of oil and you wouldn't want it spilling everywhere. Since we did get oil all over the oil pan, we're spraying a general cleaner on there and wiping it off to keep it nice for the customer and the next mechanic that has to work on it. Once that's out of the way, find your new oil filter and apply a, a dab of oil around its ring. Make sure there's only one oil filter gasket you're putting on. If you have two, you're going to run into a huge leaking problem, so be sure there's only one. Now, because this is an awkward location for a vehicle, first you're going to snug it up with your fingers, and then it's okay to move on to an oil filter wrench to further snug it up. However, you don't want to torque it too hard, for you don't want to strip anything, so snugging is just fine. Once that's out of the way, go ahead and lower the vehicle back onto the ground and locate your oil cap. Go ahead and remove that now. Once that is out of the way, you can go ahead and slide a funnel right in. This 2003 Tahoe takes 6 quarts of oil, so we're going to add 5.5 and, and check. After we've added our 5.5, we're going to turn the engine on for about 15 seconds to cycle the oil through and add as needed. Keep adding oil until the oil level registers to right where that third dot is shown right here. Thank you so very much for watching. We hope we've helped you with this repair and more to come soon. So hit the sub box below and we'll catch you next time.